Number 7. Richard Simmons Died 13th July 2024 Age 76 years Hollywood Hills, Los Angeles, California, United States Richard Simmons was an American fitness personality, actor, and comedian, best known for his vibrant personality and enthusiasm for health and fitness. He was born on July 12, 1948, in New Orleans, Louisiana. Throughout the 1980s and 1990s, Simmons gained fame for his energetic workout videos, his presence on television, and his unique approach to fitness, which emphasized body positivity and self-acceptance. Richard Simmons was credited with changing the perception of fitness by appealing to people of all shapes and sizes. He emphasized the importance of loving oneself and staying active for health rather than just for appearance. His commitment to helping people achieve their fitness goals has inspired millions and he remains a beloved figure in the world of fitness and wellness. Despite his fame, Simmons stepped back from the public eye in the mid-2010s, leading to speculation about his well-being. His absence from the public sphere cultivated much curiosity, but he had maintained privacy about his life in past years. Number 6. Christina Sandera July 18. Christina Sandera, the longtime lover of Clint Eastwood, passed suddenly on July 18, and her cause of death has been determined. Christina was a 61-year-old philanthropist. Christina passed away after a heart attack, according to a Monterey County Health Department spokesperson. On July 18, Christina Sandera's death was made public by Clint Eastwood. He remarked how much he would miss her and called her a lovely, caring woman. Although the Warner Brothers representative made the public announcement, she later stated that no further information about her passing would be released. Clint Eastwood met Christina Sandera at his Mission Ranch Hotel and Restaurant in Carmel-by-the-Sea, California, where she worked as a hostess. Number 5. John Mile died, 22nd July 2024, age 90 years, California, United States. John Mile is a pioneering British blues musician, singer, and songwriter, often hailed as the godfather of British blues. His influence on the genre has been profound, shaping the sound of blues music in Britain and inspiring countless musicians. Mile was born into a musical family and exhibited talent early on. He took an interest in various musical styles, but it was the blues that captivated him. After studying at the Manchester College of Art, he moved to London in the early 1960s, where he began performing in clubs. This was a vibrant time for blues music in the UK, and Mayal quickly became a central figure. In 1963, he formed the band John Mayal and the Blues Breakers. His contributions to music have earned him numerous accolades, including induction into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame as part of the Blues Breakers and a Lifetime Achievement Award from the British Blues Awards. Mayol's music has also influenced genres beyond the blues, impacting rock, jazz, and pop musicians. In addition to his musical accomplishments, Mayal is known for his dedication to the blues genre and his ability to adapt to changing musical trends while still maintaining his roots. Number 4 Giulio Filio died 23 June 2024, age 26 years, Tampa, Florida, United States. Giulio Filio was an American rapper and gang member from Jacksonville, Florida, known for his role in both Jacksonville's burgeoning rap scene and gang wars. Due to his feuds with fellow rappers and diss tracks directed at rival gangsters, he grew up in the Moncrief neighborhood and was a member of the six-block set of the street gang KTA, Kill Them All. His father, Charles Andrew Jones, was murdered in a 2011 shooting in Jacksonville. On June 23, 2024, two days after his 26th birthday, Jones was fatally shot and three other men were wounded after three people armed with a pistol and two rifles opened fire on them in number three. 
Martin Phillips, died. 28th July 2024, age 61 years. Number 3, Martin Phillips, died. 28th July 2024, age 61 years. Martin Phillips was a New Zealand musician, best known as the frontman and songwriter for the band The Chills, one of the pioneering groups in the Dunedin sound music scene that emerged from New Zealand in the early 1980s. His contributions to music, particularly in the realm of indie and alternative rock, had left a significant legacy. Martin Phillips was born on March 24, 1963, in Dunedin, New Zealand. He grew up in a musical environment and developed an interest in music at an early age. He began playing guitar and formed his first band in his teens. Phillips had been known for his evocative lyrics and unique vocal style, which have influenced many musicians in the indie and alternative rock spheres. The Chills had been involved in various projects, live performances, and tours worldwide securing their status as one of New Zealand's most important musical acts. Number 2. Erica Ash died 28th July 2024, age 46 years, Los Angeles, California, United States. Erica Ash attended the prestigious Spelman College in Atlanta, Georgia, where she earned a degree in sociology and theatre. Following her graduation, she pursued a career in entertainment, starting with her work in stand-up comedy. Her comedic talent led her to perform at various clubs and festivals, gaining recognition for her sharp wit and engaging stage presence. Ash's television career includes notable roles in several popular series. She gained significant attention for her role in the sitcom In the Cut, which showcased her comedic abilities and charisma. She has also appeared in shows such as Mad TV, where she honed her sketch comedy skills and Survivor's Remorse, where she played a prominent role that showcased her dramatic talents. Erica Ash's legacy lies in her ability to bridge the gap between comedy and drama, showcasing her versatility as a performer. She had broken barriers for women of color in comedy and television, serving as an inspiration for aspiring artists. Number 1. Danielle Selznick Film producer Daniel Selznick died of natural causes at his retirement home. Thursday, born on May 18, 1936 in Los Angeles, Selznick was the youngest son of iconic film producer David O. Selznick and legendary theatrical producer Irene Meyer Selznick. Selznick was the grandson of Louis B. Meyer and his first wife Margaret Schenberg Meyer, the obituary said. Selznick died at the Motion Picture Country Home in Woodland Hills, California. Selznick grew up in Beverly Hills. He graduated from the George School and Harvard University and attended the University of Geneva and completed graduate work at Brandeis University. Selznick also produced the television miniseries Blood Feud and Hoover vs. the Kennedys, among others. For many years, he served as the director of the Louis B. Mayer Foundation. Producer Daniel Selznick The last direct link to one of Hollywood's founding families died Ogder One at the Motion Picture and Television Funds Country Home Campus in the Woodland Hills area of Los Angeles.